Gut health was once a topic no one really considered, but since more and more consumers started to think about their health and what they are putting into their bodies, gut health has become a go-to word in the health sector. The term refers to keeping your digestive tract healthy. A healthy body can usually regulate the amount of good bacteria in the gut, but things like diet and stress can affect it. With the increase in diagnosed digestive disorders such as Crohn's disease, celiac disease and IBS, consumers are keen to consume foods and drinks that benefit their digestive system and keep them healthy. Due to this, brands are catching on to the trend and are launching convenient foods, drinks and supplements which claim to support gut health. Two of these brands are UK-based functional food company and Simprove. Both companies have launched innovative products that claim to support the digestive system. We spoke with Alessandra Bester of Functional Food Company and Barry Smith of Simprove to find out more. We are primarily made of bacteria, so if this is majority of our body, anything that happened to the bacteria in our body will impact on our health, on our immune function, on our digestive function. Um, there are very, very good evidence of, you know, mothers who um, having gut problems like IBS giving birth to a children who are 50% more likely to be obese before they sit in front of computer and eat carbs. They are already um, set on the road of, of having to struggle with weight. So it's it's tremendously important subject matter because it, it borderline on diabetes, borderline on other health problems. Overuse of antibiotics is something that Barry Smith of Simprus believes could be the cause of bad functional health. He believes consumers are starting to better understand inflammatory diseases. The reality is it's, uh, the news is getting out there that inflammatory disease uh, situations are on the increase. Um, and there's a whole host of those uh, which include um, IBS, uh, IBD, which includes Crohn's and ulcerative colitis and diverticular disease. Uh, and then that uh, uh, moves over to uh, skin problems, psoriasis and eczema uh, and various other problems that uh, develop all through a, a general inflammation of the gut. And because uh, that is clearly on the increase and uh, more and more people are suffering. I Products which improve gut health have traditionally been dairy based. However, as Functional Foods IB Snack and Simprove show, there can be a range of non-dairy functional foods which also improve gut health. A lot of uh, people are producing coconut or seeds-based product now because they see the importance of uh, consuming more fat and the right kind of fat. So one could say, yes, uh, you know, science goes parallel with the food, but science, uh, sorry, um, Food production also goes parallel with the conditions that people suffer. Not everyone in the food industry will go and produce a product because the science said, let's emphasize the fat right now. There are some people who come from a place where they see that um, obesity in children uh, it is crisis, that mother is giving birth to children, they pass on their gut biota to them and the gut biota it's not healthy something children shouldn't be inheriting when asked about where the category of functional food for gut health could go in the future both our experts have different views but both agree that there must be more studies into the effects and remedies for how we can avoid gut health problems um well what i would love to see obviously being you know associated with the function of foods i'd love to see functional food medicine being practiced uh, in NHS facilities um, and, you know, educating um, children from a very early age on preventative measures. It's only the modern world that wants to pop a pill for everything and that needs to change. Well, I, th I think uh, there is a tendency towards, well, there clearly, there clearly is a tendency towards more uh, independent studies. I think it's important for the industry to make connections with uh, uh, particularly the medical fraternity to have the technology measured because otherwise it will always be seen as the uh, uh, a second rate poor brother to uh, pharmaceuticals when there is clearly the potential for this technology to overtake uh, pharmaceuticals in a, in a lot of areas. Mm -hmm.